can do weird skin colors. Hairstyle. I think I like the hair though. But let's have a look. Can we make it fabulous? 15 for the love of God. Hang on. I'm going to have to go back and check 15. But I think I want the fabulous hair. Okay, what was 15? <laughs> Look, I'm not sure I'm at that part of my life yet. Um, face shape. Right, so it gets even better here. The detail is actually quite astonishing. It's pretty good. Yeah, I think I like that overbite sort of situation. I'm going to go with 46. Gandalf the Fabulous. <laughs> it's real. Shouldn't have called him Toby. What eyes, dude? You can't see him. Oh, wait. Yes, we can. Oh, dude. That's more Gandalf than ever, isn't it? The, the intense Gandalf eyes of like, I've seen some shit, man. Oh, that's hot. Look, yeah. We're going, we're going intense uh, G-Dog eyes. I don't know why they make you choose the name first when you don't even develop the character. Yeah, look. You're not wrong. All right. You reckon, what, like one-eyed? Are we going to go, like, full dank? Name should always come last. I agree. It might have something to do with the Japanese-ness of it, because they tend to just... I read an interesting article a while ago. I like that. Done. 34. Stinkai. He's doing it for me. Hang on. What was the 34? You like that? The stink guy? Alright, okay. I read an interesting article. Yeah, I do quite often. A little while ago. Um, talking about the differences in character creation between uh, Western games and Eastern games. Uh, Western games, you know, the, the players want all the customization at the, at, the, at the top end. You know, you create your character um, completely before you even jump into the game. Whereas the Eastern audience wants to earn the upgrades, which is why you have... Um, you know, unlockable cosmetic sort of stuff. I still prefer Western. <laughs> Personally. Um, but it was certainly an interesting read. Alright, we're going for the raised eyebrow. Just, it suits the, it suits the stink eye too good. I think I like the nose that we've got, but let's have a look. Oh, oh, hang on. Is it possible to have an even better nose than we currently have? The answer, I think, is yes. I'm liking 34. Where is a game where you earn the scars as you fight? That would be pretty cool. <laughs> I think old mate is going to need a lot of unlockable cosmetics. Maybe. Say we stern out loud. <laughs> well, look, I've just done it. I've done it for you. I've made your dreams come true. All right. And the mouth? The mouth is the greatest part. Oh, God. That's, that's disturbing me on a very deep and personal level. Didn't Fable add scars as you got? I don't, I've never played Fable. Don't really know. No, I like, I like the lips that we've got currently. And ears doesn't even matter too, because we can't see him. It's fine. It's fabulous Gandalf. <laughs> the, uh, the lesser known counterpart to Handsome Jack. All right, let's get some, oh fuck, I forgot that he was tiny. <laughs> You should have a fiver, Ricardo. Tell me more. The mouse should be the most sensuous part. Well, in many ways it is. Um, all right, so we can adjust the height here. So guys, let me know. Do you want to keep him tiny? Is a tiny, fabulous Gandalf with the six pack and the barrel chest? Or do we make him, you know, a, a, a big boy? Making his tiny a reason for him to have long hair is to hide them. Or make him really big. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is... Look, I don't mind that. <laughs> tiny, maybe a little less gut. Tall. Tiny dad bod for the win. Well, hang on. If we're making pickle slash tiny Rick, we can... <laughs> tiny dad bod. <laughs> We've kind of made a tiny dad... Look, but he's also... I, I actually really like this because this plays into the whole fabulous Gandalf thing. Because... <laughs> Green Dolph. He's kind of like a hobbit. Look at the feet. <laughs> Green for Pickle Rick. Gan Dwarf. It's true. 
All right, musculature, let's do it. This is, this is what I love about this game, just the detail you can go into. I can really define his fucking muscles. <laughs> I don't even know, dude. Should we make him just... To, oh, that this this makes me uncomfortable. I think we were, we were more on the mark with sort of the, the mid-ground, but I can make him a little more muscly here. Right, then we can just, like, completely change the shape of his bod. This is fantastic. What other game lets you do this? This is incredible. I mean, I'm sure there are a few. I actually, I really like what we've got going. This playthrough must be shirtless. We might be able to get that going. All right. This is fantastic. Otherwise, it's pointless. Look, guys, come on, though. Name another game that actually lets you set your character's posture. That's incredible. I am going to make him a little more hunched over Gandalf style. Even, even the stance. Ladylike or fucking macho as shit. <laughs> we might be able to make this, uh, make this shirtless. All right. Do we want makeup for him? A fabulous Gandalf. I'm having a difficult time getting over how fabulous the hair is. It's pretty fabulous. I'll tell you one thing. Going through this character creation is just making me more excited for Monster Hunter World. Any way to rename? We should be able to. Without losing the changes? I think so. Oh, facial hair. I forgot about that. But, oh man, it kind of works though. I like that. Unless we go like, how... <laughs> That's still good, you know. Wrinkles? I mean, he's got a few. He's about as, all right, it's as deep as it gets there. And, uh, and scars. No, I like that scar. That's why he's got his eyes, his, his eye closed, rather. Okay. Edit basic information. Such as the name. There we go. Okay. Oh, 